welcome to the channel if you use sketchly or most motivando apps like e-marketing e-commerce app online stores and so on you must have seen some kind of images or even in fiverr you must have seen some kind of image images at the top that display something out to slide so today i'll be showing how we can do this in sketchware when i touch it it will stop auto sliding so we'll do this in sketchware so first thing first you create your sketchware project if you are watching this video you must at least first know how to set up your firebase accounts and create a firebase project so i've done all that and i come to sketchware I enable Firebase with my config, my detail, my Firebase details. So the next thing, I added two image, two buttons, which the first one is to pick image. So as I added the button, I added this component, this component. You can name anything you want with an image name type. And added my Firebase database component. You can name it whatever you want. And a Firebase storage component. This is where we will store the image, we will upload the image. Why the database is for storing the URL of the image. So, first thing first, I also added a view pager component with my custom view since we are extending the adapter by custom view you can name your custom view and it added the image view image view widgets so we connect it we connect the uh, the widget to the custom view So after all the components being added, we are going to add this block, this block to pick to pick images. I'm going to pick images. So when the image is picked, you come here. Mine has already been added. You check box on files picked. So. Mine has already been added. On files picked, we set images from the pick file. So, we set image from the pick file. Okay, so the project will be on Sketchly. So now we add all these component. This is your upload progress. So it will not be as if you are not communicating. So this is the way you know your your app is actually responsive to Firebase. So we track the the progress of the images being uploaded this way by adding this block, your toast block, your join operator block join and okay no need of the join and so you add your your long block so this is it so before doing this what you should do is when upload button is clicked so we are uploading because on files picked we have already string string it to get the location of the image 
in your phone so we have saved the location in this in this string so we are uploading it with the name of the with the name of the picked image and also the location to the image so your files picked here we store the location so this is the location part equals to but in in android is called getting the URL, the uri or you can say the file part of a of a, of a file the path to a file so when the image is successfully uploaded we create we add this map variable create new map with this key please take notice of these keys because that's what you use to retrieve the data so on child added we get all the data to a list map the set view, view page adapter you also do the same for on child remove and on child change if you are making changes to the data and deleting it so on by custom view of the view page all you don't need to do is as you can see we use the key we use in uploading this URI, url so we set image so that is all please i will upload the project on sketchly if it helps you download it and recommend to others it will motivate me to upgrade it and if you need more you can also request on sketchly please don't forget to subscribe thank you